before we start, I'm just gonna say that I am extremely sick, so that's why there's no webcam. I'm like dying in bed today, but as soon as I'm done with this update video, I'm going back to sleep. Yeah. So that's why my voice is a little off, but I'll try to make this as quick as possible. So, today we're going to go over the update video, so it'll go over Japan and both global. So, first thing first, we got, you know, three pearls for extended maintenance, one more pearl because there is a, where is it, this thing, Shikamaru story, uh, pretty much this is based on the Japan uh, Shippuden, and Shikamaru's story is the current story being out right now, so We'll get one pearl until what? Uh, one pearl till February 16th, and then there's a second round where it's now from now till January 24th, which is two times the EXP for story. So if you want to level up, this is your time to do it. And then we don't know much about the third, uh, third event, but it says uh, in the beginning of February. So we'll know probably like. Uh, next week or the the week after the guy bundle is back We have body element up, but it doesn't include Eno or Ten Ten uh, The featured six stars at least are Rin Naruto and Haku personally I'm not pulling on this banner because I have all three of them and even if I didn't have all three uh, I wouldn't pull on it So let's see uh, these are now these are Naruto's limit broken stats. For those of you didn't know, what else do we have? Uh, Drobo is back. The limit break Jiraiya trials are back, and then we're going to get in a day or two. Uh, oh wait, Oof, actually I think it's today, right? Starting yeah, one eighteen Wednesday, so that's today. Uh, Thirteen. EST, so that's one o'clock. So two hours from now, or at least from when I'm doing this video, we're going to get Jirai raid. Sorry, uh, Orochimaru raid. So his abilities, they, they won't show up until the first time. Oh, my bad, my bad. His abilities won't show up until um, he comes out for the first time. But they are because we know them from Japan. Uh, Fifteen twenty. HP and 1136 attack or you can limit break him to 150 so that's 2000 HP and 1616 attack he's mid-range so those are solid stats for mid-range like limit broken so for free character he competes with like a pullable um, he's a little better than a pullable uh, mid-range he reduces uh, his field skill uh, boosts critical rate by 1.3 to 1.8 times his body skill reduces the chance of being of receiving a mobilization by 20% and his jutsu is 3 point for 4 chakra 3.2 attack towards one enemy in range and then ultimate is 6 attack towards all enemies in range and then for 4 turns allows you to block up to 2500 damage so it's honestly a pretty solid character uh, I don't know if I'll go for the limit break I might bring him to like 130 140 but I'm definitely going to get him and then his abilities are uh, boost health by 100 boost health by 100 uh, restores 300 health when moving on the map twice and then last ability is boost critical rate by 1.5 the 300 health when moving on the map is should be when moving between maps it's not just by dragging your character around you gain 600 health so that is uh let's see what am i missing that is that uh did i go over everything uh next week we're getting kushina raid so for those of you who miss Kushina, she is a 6 star. Uh, now she's not that good compared to the current 6 stars, but, uh, you know, free 6 star. So this is just announcing that Kitomaru will come back next week, and then we still have this banner for, I think, another week? Uh, whatever it is, I'm not playing on that one either. And then we still have this for one more week, right? Endless Ruler, Gara Raid. So, let me make sure I didn't miss anything on this side. 
price adjustments for like UK, India, and Turkey, so those don't affect anyone global. Well, not global, those don't affect anyone US. Uh, what else? New Limit Broken characters. So, Kitamaru and Kimimaru. I guess they're just finishing up the five stars, they want them all to be Limit Broken. <laughs> and that about covers. Uh, yeah, that about covers uh, global. Also, for the body banner, it is. Uh, if you guys remember from the Team Minato banner, the first two pulls are multi, and then uh, the third pull is 50 but guaranteed. And you're guaranteed one of the six stars. So if you're going for Rin, who is really good, uh, you know, you have a 33% chance of getting Rin. So let's open up JP. Woo! Uh, right here. I don't know why it moved. Right. So JP got the same limit breaks as us, they got the same Might Guy bundle. And then um, they also have a change in banner rates. So for these four banners specifically, uh, new character banners, elemental character banners, five-star guaranteed banners, and blazing festival banners. Well, I think that's about all of them. Uh, the 3% characters, uh, the chance of getting a 3% character has dropped from 53 to 26%, so more than half has dropped. And then four-star characters is almost doubled, 35 to 62%. So not bad, right? Uh, four stars still includes awakened three stars, but the chance of getting at least an awakened like regular three stars are absolute garbage. So at least you're getting awakened three stars rather than regular three stars. Uh, I think that about covers everything on this page. We'll go here. I already went over my guy. So we have a new skill support campaign features Yamato, who's a new character, and Sakura. Yamato is short range. These are his stats. His First jutsu is to one enemy and it does 4.5 attack, so it's a pretty solid ratio. And then we have Sakura, who you know most people know, but yeah, let me show the ultimate. Ultimate is uh, 8 chakra, 6 times attack towards all enemy in range, 70% chance of jutsu ceiling. So it's it's really good. Right, Jutsu Seal, a whole bunch of characters, pretty solid. And then, uh, yeah, that, that's about it. So, it is uh, 1% chance to get both characters, which is about the same, it's not it's not too much, but the other, other characters on there that are skill also increased. So, I think we have Orochimaru for one more day, and then there is a new Naruto Two Tails banner. Uh, not a banner, sorry, raid that is coming next week. No, not next week. My bad, my bad. Uh, it is coming. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Uh, I actually don't know. Doesn't seem like. Yeah, yeah, I have no idea where when it's coming. It doesn't seem to say it. Or if it does, at least leave it down below so I can pin your message because I can't find it. So we don't know when the duration is, at least from just looking at this, or I'm missing it. So if you do know the duration, please link it down below. So we think he is a body type, because it says, if you translate everything, it says, um, uh, Boss is a blue Naruto Uzumaki. Yamato is advertised to be good for this mission. Forming a skill team of skilled characters is good for this mission. That doesn't necessarily mean he's body, but there's a strong chance he is. So if you didn't know where this Naruto's from, he actually appears a couple times. The first time is while we're not watching during the uh, three year gap. Uh, he goes three tails or two tails uh, in front of Jiraiya and Jiraiya has to seal him but Jiraiya almost dies. We don't actually see that unless you watch a filler episode but Jiraiya does say that. Uh, the next time he goes two tails is when he's with I believe Kakashi or Yamato chasing after Daedara. So, uh, he goes two tails then, and then someone seals him, I can't remember. 
and then the next time he goes two tails is against Orochimaru on the bridge uh, but he ends up going three he goes further than that right so he doesn't stop at two tails when he fights Orochimaru so that's kind of cool uh, we don't know what his abilities are that's all we know we're hoping that uh, because right here since it says level 100 we're hoping that there's no limit break he's a good character doesn't need a limit break but I think that about covers Naruto what else do we have oh uh, for Yamato I didn't go over his uh, field and buddy skill reduces skill elemental damage by 15 to 20 percent uh, for his field buddy skill is reduced skill elemental damage by 20 percent and then his abilities are the first four are damage taken reduced by five percent and then boost rate of jutsu ceiling by 10 percent so let's see if i missed anything else uh kushina raid is back this week this is i have no idea uh i think it's an announcement that says uh new emergency mission event will be coming soon be sure to check out the details in the march special edition of v jump to be released on january 21st so yeah i do see a january 21st in there and then three most likely stands for march so this is probably it so a new emergency mission event uh for all we know it could be a rank ryu it could be a rank scrolls it could be s rank ramen uh we don't know those are just my guesses i don't think they'd make a, a big deal about it unless those were the things being changed double check here I think Japan also got the Jiraiya Trials and Kitomaru, so they got that this week. Uh, this is the same Shikamaru, uh, you know, event that uh, Global has, except uh, Japan's is further along. So theirs is until February 9th for One Pearl, and then uh, they their double EXP already ended. So this, I don't think it's anything important. We have the skill support up, so while these characters are out for the skill banner we have some uh ramen and scrolls for you guys to do so and then this limit break is permanently there i'll show off the banner really quickly i did a single summon got uh chidori sasuke not chidori sasuke shippuden sasuke so uh that i just did one single summon so two percent for the banner cards uh ten percent overall for uh, five stars you got the 62 percent for four and 26 percent for three stars like we went over if you add them up uh, the chance of getting a five star so the silver and bronze together is 88 percent you add the 10 percent from the five so 98 and then two percent for the banner so you have a 12 percent chance of getting bronzes which is uh sorry the golds which is pretty cool uh so of the 12%, 2% is for the banner cards, and 10% is for any other gold in the game, including Awakened 4 stars. So assuming nothing changes from uh, Japan to Global, we should have the same thing. Uh, I think that'll be it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. And uh, yeah, I'm dying slowly, so I'm not going to be doing a stream anytime soon. I'm not going to be doing uh, any videos anytime soon. Uh, video meaning like, uh, most likely I'll hold off for a day or two, wait till I'm better, and then I'll start doing videos. So this one is a lot easier to make, so that's why I went out and put this one out. So thank you guys for watching, and until next time, bye.